Hey everybody, it's Joyce here, Shadow Bay Tarot with a little on you bringing you the Tarot Love Tea for Pisces, March 2020. And let's get into the tea. We want to find out what your person is thinking about you and what your current situation is in love. We do romance over here, guys. Romantic love. So just hold on to your hats. I am going to connect with spirit for Pisces and love. The zodiac sign of Pisces. Y'all know these messages don't resonate with everybody, but they do resonate with a lot of you guys. So take what resonates, leave the rest behind. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel. Join my Bayou Tribe here on YouTube. YouTube's only Bayou Tribe, as a matter of fact. And if you have already subscribed and are a member of my beautiful Evergreen Bayou Tribe, welcome back. So you guys, don't forget to share my videos. Comment down below. Hit the notification bell so you know each and every time I upload a new video or go live here on YouTube. All right, Pisces in love, what are the current energies, please, Spirit, for Pisces in love, the current energies. Zodiac sign of Pisces, current energies in love. Going into March 2020, Pisces in love. Daughter of Cups, messages of love, making you happy, Daffy. This could be you or the person you're dealing with, Pisces. Definitely some good emotions over here. The Son of Pentacles. So somebody here is moving towards you or you're moving towards them. It's a very slow moving, gradual progression. Okay, Pisces? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn sitting here looking at me. Somebody's feeling a little bashful, a little intimidated maybe. There's a very young energy about this reading. Brand new. What did I say about brand new? We have the sun. The sun. Leo and Sagittarius energy, I feel. So, guys, joy, happiness, contentment. Look, Ace of Cups wanting to fall out. I had three fall out. We also have here the Eight of Swords. Somebody doesn't know what to do with this offer. And we also have here the Ten of Swords. Good Lord, don't end it before it begins. That's what it looks like. Somebody's going to be all intimidated by the person making that offer. Because it could go either way. Either you're making the offer, Pisces, or your person is. But somebody here is all up in their head about it. There's going to be messages coming in, talks about the relationship, okay? Could be from a distance. Let me pull some more cards here because I don't want it to end. There is someone here who is stubborn and may let it go. Like, I feel like this is a young energy. However, I feel like you guys have been dealing with each other for a while. Kind of like chasing your own tail. You never really get anywhere. Start, stop, start, stop. Never really get anywhere. Father of Cups. Okay, well, that's even better because somebody is going to get out of that stubbornness here. Somebody is graduating from the page to the king in Cups. So they're going to prove that they are serious. They're trying to make a pledge that they are serious, that this is an offer 
that's never been made before, one, but that they are sincere, they are serious, and they want to be with you for the long haul. Mother of Pentacles, yeah. Wow, from the pages to the courts and the uh, father, the king and the queen here. The king being cups, water, energy, and the mother of Pentacles, earth. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus energy is sitting pretty strong here. And so is yours, Pisces. Just want to say. But there is a new beginning that is... Somebody is going to be intimidated by it. All right. They tired of the bullshit. It's either you're going to come clean. You're going to come here with something substantial, something solid. Or that's it. So this person steps up to the plate. They want a family with you, or you may have a child with this person already. But I do see new beginnings, okay? Somebody, the one making the offer is going to start out really not sure of themselves, okay? But when they realize they're going to see the shit or get off the pot, that's when they're going to come in with that serious offer. All right. What is Pisces person thinking and feeling about them? In fact, let me get another deck on this. Pisces, what is your person thinking and feeling about you? What are their intentions with you, Pisces? That was a sucky shuffle. now using the gilded tarot I was using the wild unknown now I'm on the gilded all right so major transformation here somebody manifested this somebody definitely has been thinking long and hard about this situation with you Pisces so let's see what your person is thinking and feeling about you and what their intentions are Pisces person, please, spirit, what is the person Pisces is dealing with? What are their thoughts, feelings, and intentions for Pisces? Whoa, we got the seven of swords. They're not telling you all their feelings. That's what this is, okay? They're not telling you how deeply they feel about you. They're hiding how intense their emotions are for you. The emperor, however, they do want that stability with you. They do want a forever commitment. They want to make that move. This could be someone a little older than you or vice versa. This is someone who has a good career going, financially stable for a lot of you. And they're not spilling the tea on how deeply they do love you. And that's where I think the confusion comes in. They like cut around the corner. Like they really, you know, leave you guessing. But, you know, this person really does love you. The tower is going to shake it all up. The foundation is going to stay strong and stable, okay? But you see that seven of swords energy cannot withstand that little shake up with the tower. Because guess what? This person has to come clean about how they feel and what their intentions are that they're hiding from you or they're going to lose you. Three of Cups. New beginnings, celebrations, in love, joyful to be celebrating an engagement here. The High Priestess moving forward, trusting that intuition. She spilled all those secrets with these cups. All that love came out. All right? That love came out. So, yeah. Someone who has not been telling you exactly how they feel about you. Mm -hmm, they don't want to lose you. They want a commitment. And they are going to spill the tea on how they truly, really feel. 
which will surprise you. And there you go. Ace of Wands. Divinely guided. Underneath the deck is the Ace of Pentacles. So yeah, it's all coming together. Whew. The Hierophant is sitting right underneath this. And so is the Ace of Cups. Somebody here is going to offer an apology. Because they made you wait a little bit. They should have offered you this a long time ago. But they didn't. They were hiding how they feel. See that soulmate love? That two of cups behind this person? Yeah, they regret not telling you sooner, but they are definitely in it to win it. They are definitely wanting to put the work in and start that solid relationship. You know, they couldn't decide what to do before. For some reason, this person was just afraid. They were just afraid. Let me pull a romance angel on this. Ah, all right. All right, Pisces in love. What is the near future messages for the zodiac sign of Pisces in love? All right, Pisces in love. Children, your love life is being affected by children. I really feel, I'm not saying that somebody out there doesn't have a child for this person. That's highly probable and possible. But that would be a 1% or 2%. I really don't feel like that's the strongest meaning behind this for this reading. I feel that someone has a childish outlook a childish energy okay they handled things poorly in the past because they were being immature engagement there you go friend your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment so they were childish in the past but now they bring in it they are bringing with them a true, real, stable commitment and offer that they hope you do not refuse. And that is what's cooking <laughs> in March 2020 for the Zodiac sign of Pisces. You guys, thank you so much for watching. Comment down below. Share my video. Subscribe if you haven't. I really appreciate it. And hit the notification bell. And I will see you soon.